How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And if you're looking for a VPN with dedicated IP servers, here are three options for you guys. So we've got CyberGhost, NordVPN, and Surfshark. If you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, by the way, you'll find links to pricing and discounts as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about these VPNs. So let's start with CyberGhost. Now, CyberGhost has a dedicated IP option right here but you will have to purchase it. So this is a, an IP address that you get for you and you only. And you can definitely purchase that also with NordVPN. But the cool thing about NordVPN and Surfshark is that, so as you can tell here with the specialty servers, we don't have any dedicated IP options. And if you switch to the OpenVPN protocol, that option will be available. So with these servers, um, you will always get the same IP address. So 2925 will always have the same IP address. 4974 will always have the same IP address. So they're static. And that's exactly what it's called in Surfshark right here. Static IP addresses. You have less regions with Surfshark, I think. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six in terms of dedicated IPs, just dedicated IPs. So one, two, three, four, five. Oh, actually, Surfshark has more. Very interesting. Now, Surfshark does have 95 countries. NordVPN has 60 countries. And CyberGhost has about 90 countries, 90, 91 countries. So there is a paid dedicated IP service with NordVPN. And with CyberGhost, you don't get any free dedicated IPs. These are shared dedicated IPs with NordVPN and Surfshark, and you can definitely purchase your own with NordVPN. But um, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an extra option right here. You can buy your own dedicated IP with uh, CyberGhost. Um, you know, obviously a dedicated IP will always give you the same IP address as opposed to the dynamic IP addresses uh, with the uh, regular server. So every time you connect to one of the regular servers, you'll get a different IP address. Uh, but if you connect to a dedicated IP address, you always get the same IP address. And it can be very useful if you're trying to access your bank account, because if you constantly try to access your bank account from different IP addresses, it might suspect fraud uh, or fraudulent activity. So they might block you. Um, so you want to avoid that. Or if you want to avoid constantly getting these CAPTCHA, if you use a VPN with different IP addresses and whatnot, you might get a lot of these CAPTCHA prompts. And if you don't want to have to keep doing these, you can use a dedicated IP address server in order to not have to go through that over and over again. It can be pretty annoying. Um, so these three VPNs are perfectly great for privacy, speed, streaming, and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features, which is why I picked these three. Um, besides that, if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below. So feel free to take advantage of them while they last. And of course, you'll find the reviews down below if you'd like to learn more about them. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.